Welcome guys to the first episode in Python programming. Here we're going to install the Anaconda Python distribution for Linux environment. So let's get started. Um, so I'm on Google, I'm going to search for download Anaconda of course. Uh, download Anaconda. And uh, let's click here anaconda.org and we're going to go to download Anaconda. From here I'm going to select 3.6 version. So let's copy the link and I am going to open the terminal. Let's see. Let's copy this link. All right, it is downloading. Beautiful. Wow, it's taking quite some time, yeah? All right, 7%. Uh, gotta wait. What are you gonna do, right? Well, well, well. Actually, it's not bad. It's quite fast. Right, thirty-four percent. All right. Almost there. Almost there. <laughs> All right, it's 15, 60. Okay. Well, we're almost there. Yeah? So <laughs> hang in there. You just got to go through the process, I guess. And we are ready to install. Brilliant. Great. So. Let's clean it out and I'm going to say bash anaconda. Okay, so this is the file we just downloaded. So I need, just need to run it. And it's going to say, okay, please enter to continue. I'm going to say, let's say, press enter. Got to agree with the terms and conditions. Okay. Press yes to accept the terms. Okay, now he's going to ask me whether if I want to install to the, the um, Anaconda distribution to the home directory, which is, of course, that's the right thing for me to do. So I'm going to say yes. In this case, it's just press enter. Okay. Brilliant. It's installing now. Let's say it's three point six point five. Okay, we almost there. Okay, it's still installing all the packages we need. So we just gotta wait, eh? Okay, now it's gonna ask me like if I wanna have the Anaconda three uh, to set to my path variable because which is important to do it. If you didn't do it, then of course later on you could set it up. But it's better off you doing it right now. So I'm gonna say yes. This way, my default Python library will be the one that I'm installing right now. So let's go ahead and say yes for it. All right, and do I need to uh, proceed with the Microsoft VS? code no absolutely not so let's say no for that and I'm all set let's clear this thing out exit and I'm going to open the terminal again 
let's type Python. There you go. I have the 3.6.5 version installed on my Linux computer. Brilliant. Cheers, guys.